All right, guys, another quick daily toy hunt video. So these ones have been really quick only because I've been super busy this past week um, with work and stuff at the house. So we'll be getting back to regular scheduling, scheduling uh, next week. But I do have a toy hunt tomorrow with uh, Joey. That's going to be a really good one. Probably a longer version of it. And then, um, but it's the, what do they call it? The Holothon, the NECA, the NECA stuff. Um, the Neckathon, whatever it's called, that thing they're doing. Um, Neftali, if you're watching this, he supposedly got me the glow in the dark Muckman one. So we'll see if uh, if that uh, comes through. But um, that's part of the exclusive. But I want to see if this target got anything, and it doesn't doesn't look like they did. See, this is like exactly the same. I don't think it's hit down here just yet. I because I haven't seen anybody local post anything. Look at this. This is the first time finding one of these in stores and at Target too, not at Walmart. So really nice to see this. I'm gonna see if the eyes are blacked out on him. Yeah, see the eyes are blacked out on this one. Some people said theirs wasn't that blacked out. This one is, but really cool to see this one in store. And you can see the bicycle thingy is on sale here too at $40. And then there's a lot of the unmasked uh, Bruce Wayne. Oh, they got the masked version and the unmasked version right there. And then Armored Batman. And they got some of the uh, other DC multiverse stuff. More, another one, another Drifter. Two of them. Jeez, it's quite a few of them. Dude, look at Over here, we have a Riddler. And then we have a Bat Cycle. Dude, I still want to pick up another one of these just because of how cool these freaking cycles look. And then this Catwoman's been here for a minute. There's another one there. And then same thing with these Riddler. You can they have three Riddlers here. You can army bullet them. All right, guys, so Nathali came through yet again, and um, he managed to find, for me, the new NECA Wolfman. This is the black and white version. I'll tell you, the box art on this one is 10 times better. I think this one looks fantastic. Look at that. This is the back. I thought that was the front. Uh, this is the front right here. I actually prefer this side. It's the figure, but here's the front, the poster. There's the inside. Oh, baby, look at that. That looks so good. I'll definitely be doing reviews on this one. And then we got Muck Man. So basically, just like this one here, it's a repaint. So let's open. Like, this has, like, some texture to it. The front, just feeling that right now, this is all texture. I'm going to test the glow-in-the-dark feature on it. But I don't think there's any difference in the figure itself. I think it's pretty much just the same, just the glow-in-the-dark feature. But let's try that out. All right, I, it's freaking dark in the garage, and I'm kind of scared. So let's uh, test this out here. So we got the black light. Give it a little, 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 little shine there. Let's check it. Boom. Oh wait, does it glow? That doesn't glow that great. All no, right, it's not. It's. I was hoping it'd glow a lot better. I mean, I'm shining on it pretty well. Okay, it's decent. It's. I honestly thought this was going to glow a lot better. Let's test out the cover. Oh, that, see, that glows good. This glows really good. It's kind of crazy that the packaging glows better than the actual figure. The figure does not glow the, the best. Um, let's test out the back. Okay, that's it. That would have been cool if the whole box glowed, kind of like how Super 7 does theirs. But that's still pretty cool. All right, guys, so that's the video for today. I didn't find these in stores. Um, my buddy did, and uh, I know Richard actually found a couple things for me too. I'll be seeing him tomorrow. Uh, I'm filming this late tonight. This is a late toy hunt, daily toy hunt. Uh, we're gonna be doing a toy hunt video tomorrow morning, which is gonna be Sunday the 13th. So stay tuned for that video. We're going to somewhere. We're going somewhere that we're all excited for. It's the first time that we've ever gone to this place that we're going to, but we're really hyped for it. Um, yeah, so I, now I just need Biff. I, really, I know I don't collect the NECA Back to the Future figures. I have a couple of the figures, but I want that Biff from Back to the Future Part 2, and I need that TMNT 4-pack. Uh, I know they found the Pizza Monsters out there too. I was going to get another one, but I already have two of them, but um, they're, they're hitting two. Uh, it looks like from what everyone's been showing me, there's a lot of Muckmans, a lot of Metalheads, and a lot of the uh, Pizza Monsters, but of course the four-pack is not easy to find. Same with the Gargoyles and uh, Biff. And I, I don't know about this one. I don't know if this one's easy or not. 
But let me know in the comments down below, guys, if you're out hunting for this. The hunt continues. Good luck out there, guys. Thank you, everybody, for watching. And, you know, you know, and if Dolly, thank you. Richard, thank you for helping out in the community. And we'll see you soon for more toy hunting videos.